this run of river power plant harvests the natural energy of falling water from the river to generate electricity, producing clean and renewable energy. The pond and the tailwater here is about at a 35 foot differential. So uh, that's your potential energy and the water runs uh, down through the units and falls at 35 feet. Uh, each one of our units is uh, turning about uh, 62 RPM and it passes about uh, 30,000 gallons a second. From nearly a mile away at the bridge, it's hard to see how much power the river produces, but this hydroelectric plant has been producing power for 99 years. This weekend, they'll give you a look back to celebrate. It was built between 1910 and 1913. It was uh, uh, quite a feat at the time. Um, you know, for three years, uh, uh, construction of a, of a plant this size is, uh, we probably couldn't get permits for it uh, in today's world. When the Keokuk Energy Center was built, it was far ahead of its time, breaking several records, including highest transmission line, longest line, and largest transformers. They've done a spectacular job building the plant. There's very few areas here that we can look at and say, you know, they really made a mistake here. This doesn't look like it was the way it should be. I mean, uh, the guys were uh, uh, very good craftsmen, and uh, it's a very well-built plant. The walking tour will take you across the lock and into the actual power plant where you can learn more about its history. Chrissy Mueller, KHQA News, Keokuk.